Hello guys, welcome back to... I don't even know what episode we're on. I think it's episode 8. Might be episode 7. We're on an episode! Since the last one, I collected a ton of wood. Villages everywhere. So I plan on making a pen for our cows, now that we have them over here. So for that, we're going to use a shovel and some water buckets. Uh, some of you may know what I'm going to do with these, some maybe not. But, how many do we have? We have six right now, right? We want to get hundreds, so for now we'll start out small. Maybe later we can upgrade. Grab the cactus. How big should I make this? Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Let's make it fourteen. Throw some sand down. That marks the corner now. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Make it fourteen by fourteen. Uh, the effective size is going to be slightly smaller than that. You'll see why in a second. Or maybe a little longer than a second. It really depends on how long it takes to dig this out. Some of you may recognize the design. Let me get through it. From several members of the Minecraft server. Because I've... I got the idea from them and tried using it. It actually works really well, so that's what I've stuck with since then. Uh, let's... Oh, I guess we need to make a shovel. Let's make an iron shovel, finally. We've got two levels. We can put two levels on it, see if it digs any faster. Probably won't, but it never hurts to try. Now let's just make two. Why not? We have the iron. Only get enchant one of them though. Efficiency one. Good enough. Alright, let's get to work here. Get back to work, I guess. And hopefully that sheep won't be in here. This works much better. It's not quite a super shovel, but it's close. We are going to probably want a sheep pen, too. I mean, I know there's sheep everywhere, but I don't really want to go and travel around to go and find them. So at some point, I'll gather some more of them. Right now, I'm just going to kill this guy because he's annoying me. We'll go and find some later and bring them back here to another pen that we'll make at a later time. Alright, there's one deep. I think we can manage it with one deep. So, let me dig this around here. That guy was very excited to get into his new home. Alright, there's that. Let's grab our water buckets. Let's first make an infinite spring here. There we go. Alright. Is there one there? One there. Keep going. Or not. Oh, and the sun's already going down. I wonder if the music does actually mean the sun's setting. It's not supposed to, but it does seem to happen at very convenient times. Maybe, maybe not. Doesn't really matter, I guess. 
and it keeps playing regardless of whether or not you go to bed. Alright, so some of you may have figured out how this works already, some maybe not, but mobs aren't able to swim up flowing water. So if we... That's why I made the infinite spring. If we create this cage in the middle and put water around it, the mobs that end up in here can't get out now unless we assist them in some way. So if we put all of our cows in here, they'll be unable to get out because they can't swim up flowing water. It's rather ingenious design that I'm surprised I haven't seen in more places. I'm just gonna push you down in here. There you go. Welcome to your new home. gonna do this with a few more buckets here. Probably didn't actually have to do that one. I have a third bucket. Let's get three going. One, two, three. A little bit faster. Uh, he is stuck. Don't go that way, go the other way. Jerk. Spent all of this time and resources getting you here. I'm trying to make you a nice comfy pen, but no. Actually, it's probably not all that comfortable there. Probably wet and cold and it's nothing but sand in here. Maybe if we ever get a silk touch pick, we can put some grass in here, but I don't plan on actually staying here that long. Which, while I was clearing out the spot for this wood here, I did select a good spot, get out of my way, to build a house that I'll probably devote a few episodes to. Depends on how big I feel like making it. You can look forward to that at some point. Maybe. Hopefully. Alright, we're almost done with this. And we just want to plop some fences around it. Actually, we probably want to get the cows in here first and then plop some fences around it. Okay, one more. Or maybe two more. <laughs> I almost couldn't get out there. Yeah, it looks like we only need one more. Let's fill up our other water bucket. Did I? No, I don't. Eat something because we're hungry. <laughs> then we'll grab some wheat. Or maybe not. Okay, wheat. Throw it there. Let's plant that again. Let's lure some cows. Hey you, yeah, come on, this way. Not you two, just the cows. Come on. Come on, over here. Yeah, right over here. Yeah, come on. Just keep coming. Come on, keep coming. There we go. Oh, let's kill this guy. And this guy. This is a cow pen, not a sheep pen. Although, I'm not sure where our other three cows went. There are three in there, right? Yeah. They're over here somewhere. They are not where I left them. Unless, no, there's no mobs that killed them, so... They walked off somewhere. Hmm. Well, that's odd. 
How far will they go? We have three of them, so I can still breed some more out of that, but... I was hoping I could get all six so we could breed them faster. And down here? Nope. Hmm. That is interesting. I'm not sure what happened there. I'm not sure what happened here either. That's something. That's some coal. Uh, let's grab that quickly. So I'll forget about it later. I'll probably forget about it in like two seconds. So let's grab it. Never turn down coal. Unless it's cursed, then you can turn it down. Unless you're really desperate for coal. I'll take cursed coal if I'm really desperate for it. There's actually a fairly large vein right here. Right out in the open in the middle of the desert. Okay, so I guess we're stuck with our three cows because I don't see the other ones. Anywhere in the immediate area. So, let's go and breed them. Where did they go? That That's troublesome. Anyway. So those will give us leather and meat, hopefully. And we could use the leather to make books, and maybe armor if we're really desperate. Do we have 10,000 iron, so I don't think we will be. But if it happens... And to give us meat to eat. I don't know if I said that already, but I don't think I did. Okay, make baby cows. We'll look the other way, give them some privacy. Alright, baby cow. Four cows now. Just need to give them some time to... to uh, get ready to do that again. Alright. Now, I just want to make a ton of fence posts put around it. Just part of why I gathered all the wood I did. I don't actually know how many fence posts this will make, but hopefully it'll be enough. I don't actually think it will be. Okay, that gives us 42 fences. That isn't enough, we made the cage too big. I do need a gate to get in there. Uh, why did I put all the sand away? So now things can just slip right through there. And it might be an OCD thing, OCD thing too. So that's gonna it's gonna bug me and probably some other people. So we'll fix that in a second. That isn't supposed to be there. Okay, we didn't make enough. It's all right. I need to go back and get some more sand anyway. And I think I remember how to make fence gates. I think. Maybe. Oh, that stopped cooking, so let's throw some more iron in while we're heading here. Plenty of gold. Put cactus in. Let's grab some sand. Oh, the wood's already in my inventory. Do this. Okay, this will give us our fence gate. 
only gonna have one. Uh, I think I made this more confusing by dividing it weird. Okay, perfect number. Sun setting again. So that tells me the episode's been going for a while. So we're gonna finish up with this, and I will. I'll actually be gone next week, so I'm going to record some more episodes immediately following this. So if there's an update next week, just I'm not going to have it yet because this is all today. Okay, all we need is defense gate. Then we're good. Throw my bucket. Okay. That's now complete. Almost. So we don't want our cows to be scared of the dark. So throw some torches up. Make them feel comfortable. And reduce the number of mobs that spawn. Yeah, so here is our new cow pen that we can hopefully keep expanding until we have thousands of cows and can do whatever we want with them. So until the next time, uh, hope you guys have a great day. I will see you, so will they, in the next episode. He even nodded. So did he. Goodbye.